everyone, Prestissima here. Today, we're gonna learn about key signatures. As you know, sharps, flats, and naturals are called accidentals. And as we've learned in music scores, accidentals follow several rules. For example, an accidental in front of a note in any measure will carry through to all of those same notes within that measure but not any of the measures following. Now, a bar line, which is the end of one measure and the beginning of the next measure, cancels out any of the accidentals. So if there's an accidental in front of a note here, carries through the measure, but then at the bar line, it resets. Accidentals placed at the beginning of a system carry through the entire piece and it applies to every note in every octave. Accidentals placed at the beginning of a system, okay, so they'll mark which notes have accidentals, okay, in the beginning of the system, that applies throughout the whole piece, and it applies to those notes throughout in any octave. Accidentals placed in this way at the beginning of the system is called a key signature. Key signatures tell us which notes in a piece will be sharped, flatted, or Natural. At the same time, and most importantly, key signatures will tell us what scale we're playing or what key we are playing in. The sharps and flats in a key signature, they're not assigned arbitrarily. These sharps and flats are defined specifically by the scale we're using or the key the music is in. Here are some examples. Okay, C major, we've played it, it's all white keys, has no sharps and no flats. So, the key signature for C major has no sharps and no flats. G major has one sharp, right? F sharp. G major, or the key of G major, has one sharp F sharp. So, the key signature also has one sharp F sharp. D major, right, the key of D major has two sharps. When we play the D major scale, we have F sharp, and we have C sharp. So when we have the key signature for D major, we also have two sharps, F sharp and C sharp. The scale of F, ma or F major, yes, has one flat, B flat. So the key signature for F major has one flat, B flat. The C minor scale has three flats, B flat, E flat, and a flat, okay? So the key signature for the key of C minor would have, you got it, three flats. We have B flat, E flat, A flat in the key signature. Let's look at some key signatures and see what they look like. Okay, we're gonna use our knowledge of major scales, and we know a whole bunch of them, right? And name these major key signatures. Okay, so let's see. No sharps or flats, okay? No sharps or flats in the key signature. And we know that that's C major, right? C major has no sharps or flats. So let's play it. We have C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. Back down. B, A, G, F, E, D, C. All right, that one was an easy one. Let me grab my pencil here. Okay, so that's the key of C major. Next, one sharp, F sharp. All right, we know that. That is the key of G major, right? And look, one sharp, and it's right on the F line. You see that? And that's on the F line too. The sharp is on the line so that you know that F is sharp. Cool. Let's try playing the G major scale. So we have G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, back down, F sharp, E, D, C, B, A, G. Okay, now what do we have? We have two sharps, F sharp and C sharp. We know that one, right? What major scale has two sharps? All right, the D major scale. And look, it has an F sharp and it has a C sharp. See, there's a, F, F, there's a sharp sign on the F and a sharp sign on the C. So that's two sharps. D major scale. Let's try it. Oh, and we're in the key of D major. You can see that. So let's try that. Starting on D, 
We have D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, D. Back down, C sharp, B, A, G, F sharp, E, D. Okay, next. Oh, three sharps, F sharp, C sharp, and G sharp. Which major uh, scale has three sharps? That's the major, A major scale, right? So we're in the key of F sharp, C sharp, G sharp. Key of A major. Shall we try playing that? All right, so remember, three sharps, F sharp, C sharp, G sharp. And this is our key signature. We have A, B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, G sharp, A. Back G sharp, F sharp, E, D, C sharp, Excellent. All right, I'm glad we learned all those scales, right? Next, what do we have? We have four sharps. F sharp, C sharp, G sharp, D sharp. All right, what major scale has four sharps? E major scale, good. And you'll see, we have an F sharp, C sharp, G sharp, and D sharp. So they're all right on the, basically where the note would go, right? And we see the same in the bass clef, F, C, G, D. So we are in since we're using the E major scale, this is the key of E major. Shall we play an E major scale? Let's do it. Mm, I'll start down here. All right, four sharps, right? E, F sharp, G sharp, A, B, C sharp, D sharp, E, back down, D sharp, C sharp, B, A, G sharp, F sharp, E. Very good. Okay, let's go to five sharps. We have F sharp, C sharp, G sharp, D sharp, and A sharp, right? You can see them right here. F, C, G, D, A. F, C, G, D, A. All right, this is what major scale? The B major scale. So we're in the key of B major, okay? So instead of having to write all those sharps out when you write out the scale, they put them all right here, so easy. All right, let's try playing the B major scale. Five sharps, okay? So we have B, C sharp, D sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp, B, back down, A sharp, G sharp, F sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp, B. Very good, friends. Okay, next one, no sharps or flats. Well, we did that one already. We know that no sharps or flats, is the C major scale, so this is the key of C major. Very good. All right, I'm gonna play it again, but I'm gonna play it faster. Here we go. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, B, A, G, F, E, D, C. Okay, how about this one? Okay, we're going to flats now. Now what scale do we know that has one flat, B flat? It is the F major scale, so we must be in the key of, see, B flat, B flat. We must be in the key of F. Very good. Shall we try that one? Let's do it. One flat, B flat, right? Here we go. F, G, A, B flat, C, D, E, F, E, D, C, B flat, A, Good job, friends. Let's see what this next part says. The key of C major has no sharps or flats. Well, thank you very much. We know that, right? Next, the key of F major has one flat, right? And that is B flat. All right, next. Well, should we play it? Let's play it again. I'll play it faster. F, G, A, B flat, C, D, E, F, E, D, C, B flat, A, Okay, how about the key of G major? All right, what is the key signature for G major? Well, I know it has one sharp. And that sharp is F sharp. Let's do it. We have G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, D, C, B, A, G. All right. The key of 
D major. Okay, so let's think about the D major scale. We know that the D major scale has two sharps. And those sharps are F sharp and C sharp. Okay, let's remind ourselves. I'll come down here. D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, D. C sharp, B, A, G, F sharp, B, D. Okay, I'm getting good at this. Key of A major has how many sharps? Three sharps, right? I'm starting to see a pattern here. So three sharps is F sharp, C sharp, and then G sharp. Let's play it. A, B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, E, D, C sharp, B, A. All right, let's keep going. The key of E major has What's the key signature for E major? We have four sharps, right? Four sharps, which are what are the sharps? F sharp, C sharp, G sharp, and D sharp. Four sharps. Let's try it. So we have E, F sharp, G sharp, A, B, C sharp, D sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp, B, A, G sharp, B, F sharp, E. Okay, next, the key of B major. Okay, that's the one that has five sharps, right? The scale, B major scale has five sharps. So the key of B major has five sharps. Interesting. They're kind of all stacking up, right? We see the same ones over and over. F sharp, C sharp, G sharp, D sharp, and A sharp. A whole bunch of black keys, right? Let's try that one. So we have B, C sharp, D sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp, B, A sharp, G sharp, F sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp, B. All right, good job, friends. So today, we learned about key signatures. In our next video, we're going to learn a song called Pussycat, Pussycat. And we're going to learn that song in two different keys. F major and G major. So keep practicing all your songs, sing while you play, and memorize everything. Prestissima out!